Hey guys, Tony the Soy Sass Assassin. Welcome to another episode of Cigar Review. Today's one of those days that like, you know, I feel eh. So we will try to do a new cigar today. And this is the Little Havana Miami El Titan de Bronze Cigar Manufacturer Redemption. Which I don't know what they tried to redeem. Like, did they screw up something? This is supposed to be a regular production, not a limited edition. It looks pretty good to me. So let's take a look at the cigar right now. Okay, let's go. El Titan de Bronze Redemption. Don't mistake that for any other brand because Redemption is owned by El Titan de Bronze. But that is a factory in Miami. It is made out of Ecuadorian Habano wrapper. Binder is Nicaraguan from Esteli. And filler from Jalapa and Esteli. So Nicaraguan and Nicaraguan. The size is 6x52 Toro. MSRP is $17.99. Which might sound a lot, but it's really, that's Miami. The, the labor does cost that much. They are rolled in a little factory in Miami. There's like maybe six people rolling it. From what I saw last time, I don't know if this is deeper, but anyway. Interesting cigar, Nicaraguan tobacco. Let's get right to it. All right, so this is not a cheap cigar for what it is. You know, a Toro at $17.99. Um, There's got to be a lot to it. It's, and majority of them is really, number one is the brand. And number two is directly from a factory. And number three is from Miami. And labor, labor is costly. Labor is what it is. So you're going to pay for that, right? So this is what we have right now. Let's take a look. Oh, it's very grassy and cedary. A little bit floral too. And from the foot, it kind of had a little bit of stink to it. A slightly fruity old drawer stink. Old wooden drawer stink. With a little bit of fruitiness to it. All right. And uh, since somebody complained about me not toasting my cigars, I will get a lighter that may have a little bit more butane for me to toast just a little bit longer. Hmm. Uh, this one has a little bit. All right. I do toast. It's just that I toast really quickly because really a fire is fire. Slow cook, fast cook. So long, you got you to gotta set it on fire anyway. And I don't really care for that first half a puff. I care about the transition and the flavor profile of the entire cigar. So I don't spend a lot of time because it's got to burn, right? Because you guys are waiting for me to 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 get you the flavor. You don't really want to make me to take 15 minutes to light the cigar. Trust me. Mm. Spicy, peppery, woodsy, cedar. Very spicy. Like cinnamon chili pepper. Very spicy. It's 
some mineral, some earth. Coffee. That's all I can taste right now with all the burn going through right now. It's a lot of burn. A lot of burn. Yeah. A lot of burn. So let me smoke one third and I'll be right back. I smoke a little bit more than one third. It's on the second third right now. I thought there was a flavor coming out, but it's not. It tastes... It tastes like dirt. It tastes earthy. It tastes powdery, it tastes peppery and woodsy. That's it. That's all I got. I don't know. All of a sudden, like all kind of different flavors is just not there. It's pretty empty of a flavor. Not very good star for redemption. Not very good star. So but since we're getting this band's big, so it goes close to the band. So let's let's look at the band right now. If I can take this off. I don't have any nails right now. Oh, here we go. I got it. I got it. I like this band. It's got all the information on it. It's clean. It's got design, emboss. The color looks great. I don't. Uh, yeah, this way. Here you go. I want to do it this way. This way. Everything looks good on it. The quest looks clean. The band looks clean. Has all the information on it. Where's made? What's made? Name and all that stuff is on here. That's how you do a band. Big band. Showy. Nice. Pretty. That's how it's done. I give him that. This is done right. This is done right. I like this band. Okay. Cigar. So far, not so much. But continue smoke. It's about a medium plus right now. And maybe because of this is not a lot of flavor, I smoke a little bit fast. But there's not a lot of flavor. So we'll continue. See if that flavor comes back. Second, third. You know, usually the golden ratio. Somewhere there, middle. And we'll see if that gets anywhere. But right now, not much. Just strength. Be right back. All right. Second, third. Still. It's actually the flavor is dying. The flavor is dying. There's not much to it. The retro hell, you get a little bit of trying to be cocoa, but not there. It's still powdery in mouthfeel. Pepper. It's really hard at this moment to even distinguish what's what because it's so light. The strength is there though. I don't know. Maybe it's just this cigar. But it's not not much to it. Not much to it. I'm not looking forward to the last third because it's just strength. Medium plus, just strength. Just strength right now. Uh it's kind of a little bit wet for some reason too. Uh, even though this is put in uh place is relatively dry. Like when I puff on it, some bubble comes out. So Whatever that's it's sitting there a little bit. The burn is yellow. The burn is yellow. So, I don't know. Maybe the cigar wasn't ready from the factory. So yeah, Laster, finish it up. Be right back. Laster! Did that face tell you anything? It's trying to get sweeter, it got sweeter. But not enough to justify the cigar. Alright. Not enough to justify the cigar. It does have a little bit of like a semi-floral smell to it. Uh, in the last third. But it's not enough. Like all this stuff is not enough to justify the cigar. So. Price. Mm, nine bucks. Nine bucks is where I think this is cigar deserves. So some might disagree. I know it's made in Miami. The cost is higher and all that stuff, but I really did not get much enjoyment out of the cigar. So I'm gonna give it nine bucks. Nine bucks it is. Oof. Yeah, I, I try to think about anything I can talk about the cigar. There's not much. There's not much I can talk about the cigar. This is so little of everything. You can barely tell. And you got to try very hard to find things. It's not how a en enjoyment, what I would consider as enjoyment for, for a cigar, you know. So, yeah. So that will be it for this particular cigar review. If you like it, make sure you like, subscribe, comment, share. Um, subscribe. Yep. And also uh, make sure to uh, check out our podcast. 
Check out membership and check out swag. And that will be it. This particular cigar. Um, if you didn't smoke it, you didn't miss much. You did not miss much. Like right now, I'm about to go smoke another AJ. Maybe it tastes better. So it is what it is. I'll see you guys next one. Bye guys.